Hi, Tea Tigers. It's Hi, Ms. guys. And Miss Peterson here. I probably pointed the wrong direction because my thing is backwards. <laughs> Oh well. <laughs> We're here to talk to you about our top Dreambox and AR students for this past week, the week of May 10th through the 16th. Woohoo! Dogman's excited. He can't wait. Oh yeah. He's gonna have to wait because we have an announcement Aww. before. Him. Okay, so this is gonna be our last weekly video and then Next week, we're going to be talking about the top students and classes for the year. Okay, so our cutoff for, for AR points and Dreambox lessons is at the end of the day this Friday, the 22nd. Yes. The mm -hmm. 22nd, right? Yes. And then next week, look out for two videos, one from Ms. Peterson and one from myself, to talk, where we're going to be talking about the top students and classes for the year, and I'm really excited. I can't wait. Yay. So we've got a few more days to get our uh, last tests and quizzes taken. But that doesn't mean that you can stop reading and practicing your math. That's like an always thing. Yeah, That's I just think for this Box report. Should, be read, should be going all summer long. AR will so, be as well. Yay. So have fun, you guys, and we'll get started. All right, so we have our AR leaders for the week of May 11th. Some of them are the same as last week, but some people are brand new to our leaderboards. So this is exciting. So in kindergarten, we have Valeria V from Mr. Piaz's class was leading the way. Jayla H in Miss House's class was right behind her. And Alejandro A from Mr. Piaz was right behind the two of them. So way to go kindergarten. I will say kindergarten was leading the way in the school in general this week. You kindergartners are amazing. Y'all are doing awesome in AR. Um, so our first grade readers, our first place was Christabel G from Mr. Rodriguez's class. Alina R from Ms. Cardwell's class was right behind her. And Dion S from Ms. Valdez's class is behind them. So way to go, first grade. Woo! Uh, second grade, Elijah C was our leader for Ms. Gomez's class. Isabella B um, from Ms. Tremont's class was right behind him. And Diego B from Miss Ruiz's class is behind the two of them. So way to go, you guys. In third grade, Bilal was our leader again from Miss Ryan's class. Then Abner P from Miss Matthews and Braylon M from Miss Matthews. They were behind them too. So good job. All right, so fourth grade, Yaretsi V um, was leading our fourth graders this week from Miss Gira's class. M. Saul D from Miss Redwine's class was behind her, and Corbin M from Miss Redwine's class was behind the two of them. So way to go, you guys. Keep up the good work. Um, remember, you have until the end of day Friday to take those AR tests for um, our leaders for the year. Yay! So now I'm excited to see what's going on with our dream box. Pink. Okay. So we had some changes this, this week with some of our leaders. Some, some stayed, some, some got added, and some changed order. So this is going to be interesting. But I'm really excited because all of our leaders were somewhere in the 20s, 30s, and 40s of number of lessons in a week. And that was amazing, you guys. You've been working so hard. Okay, so our top students in kindergarten were Hira from Ms. Yanez's class, Jayla from Ms. House's class, and Zachary from Ms. Allison's class. Great job, kindergarten. Good job, guys. Our top students in first grade was Hui from Ms. Valdez's class, Jeremy's back on the board from Ms. Meeks's class, and Isabella from Ms. Welch's class. Great job, guys. Good job. Second grade had had a tie for first place. Wow. Between Elijah and Miss Gomez's class and Jonathan and Miss Michelle's class. You know, those two guys worked really hard. And then in second place, we had Isabella in Miss Tremont's class and Megan in Miss Tremont's class. So good job, everybody. All right, third grade, same three kids as last week, but they're in a different order. Bilal no, pulled no. out in front from Ms. Ryan's class. Great job, dude. And then Hui from Ms. Matthews' class, and then Stephanie from Ms. Vasquez's class. Way to go, third grade. And Ooh. finally, in fourth grade, Fabiola in Ms. Garcia's class was number one, followed by Corbin in Ms. Redwine's class, and Mario in Ms. Garcia's class. It's really great to see some new names up there. I'm super excited. 
I All right, now remember, this is our last weekly video, and then next week, be on the lookout for two different videos, one from me and one from Ms. Peterson, where we're gonna be yeah. announcing the top kids for the year, okay? It's gonna be exciting, you don't wanna miss it. Wah! All right, now, have a great day, Have a great tigers. day, tigers!